Hey everyone, I'm going to show you guys a game that I've been working on for my C++ class at UCLA. So let's run it. The game is called The Archer, and basically um, it's a top-down shooting game. So when you run it initially, you're presented with an instruction screen, which tells you how to play the game, and then when you've read this, just click play. Now you spawn on a random map, it's randomly generated with walls, and then uh, there's a few initial items on the ground and the first enemy starts spawning right away. So you just pick up the items by running over them. Um, and then, as you can see, the enemy will try to find a way around the wall to get to me. But this is a certain type of enemy. It's a shooting enemy, which means um, if I get too close to it, it will actually run away from me, as you can see. OK, so if I want to actually use one of these items that I picked up, notice my inventory up here. Um, then I have to map a certain item with a certain click. So if I want the left click to launch a single arrow, then I just left click it up here, and then I just launch it at the enemy. There we go. And the enemies have random item drops, so there's a chance that they'll drop a random item, including a health potion. Okay, so the rounds get progressively harder. Um, now let's say we want the right mouse button to map to this other item that we have here. This item launches three arrows at once, like so. And then the last item that I have implemented so far is this cross arrow. So let's map that to the middle mouse button. And let's show you. Well, I'll show you when there's more enemies. It's cooler that way. So let's just get me surrounded by some enemies, and then let's use it. There we go. OK, so the purpose of the game right now is just to try to um, survive for as many rounds as you can. Uh, it progressively gets harder um, in terms of how much health the enemies have and how many of them spawn. You will eventually die, but the goal is to get as far as you can and get the highest score. Thank you.